Now you're going to want to bring that right one in a little bit, just a little bit, because the faster you go, the more it's going to be pronounced you're turning. If it looks like I'm concentrating hard, that's because I am. Navigating a 440-ton tugboat through Vancouver Harbour is no easy task. And that's exactly what this state-of-the-art simulator is here to teach you. That's what this is all about, is providing the level of training that uh, is not provided anywhere else in North America. And it's all about protecting our environment, protecting our coast, and making this port the safest port. In the first of its kind in North America, C-SPAN, the Vancouver shipping company, has acquired two state-of-the-art $1.5 million simulators aimed at providing the very latest in training for their ship operators. What's unique about our simulator is that it is the newest technology and it's also our, our facility is quite unique because it's the only one in the world where you can actually be on the simulator, working on the simulator, then three minutes later you can be actually on a boat working on the water. The two simulators feature 17 computers and 12 displays with floor-to-ceiling 360-degree views providing an immersive experience. The virtual Vancouver Harbour is replicated to exact detail, giving trainees like me a realistic and safe environment to learn in. So how long does it take to master this? So two weeks of uh, simulation like this, we do all manner of exercises, master 25 different scenarios and maneuvers. And at the end of that, we do six days or seven days of live trials on board the actual vessel with the same characteristics, but you're going to do it in real life. And eventually you'll master the skill sets that you did in the simulation. Looking out at this virtual screen, it all looks pretty empty out on the waters. But in reality, the Port of Vancouver is incredibly busy with strong tides, commercial and recreational vessels everywhere. It demands a lot of skill and precision to navigate it. So far, C-SPAN has never had a major accident involving a spilled load. But with over 3,000 vessels passing through these waters each year and predictions that tanker traffic will increase sevenfold with the completion of the Trans Mountain Pipeline project, there are serious concerns a spill could happen soon. C-SPAN is, however, confident, not on their watch. Our crews are trained. They've been doing this for 30 years without an incident. That's not going to happen. Lucky for them, I won't be captaining a tugboat anytime soon. It takes years before trainees are allowed behind the controls. And although I didn't hit any boats this time, I was told that I probably need a bit more practice. In North Vancouver, Tom Walsh, City News.